And we are back with our daily Bible readings. And of course with our daily Bible reading calendar. My name is Alan Todd Boy Jr. We're conducting our daily Bible reading for May 21st. First Chronicles chapter 15. And David made him houses in the city of David and prepared a place for the ark of God and pitched for it a tent. Then David said, None ought to carry the ark of God but the Levites. For them hath the Lord chosen to carry the ark of God and to minister unto him forever. And David gathered all Israel together to Jerusalem to bring up the ark of the Lord unto his place, which he had prepared for it. And David assembled the children of Aaron and the Levites, of the sons of Kohath, Uriel, the chief, and his brethren, 120, of the sons of Merari, Asaiah, the chief, and his brethren, 220, of the sons of Gershom, Joel, the chief, and his brethren, 130, the sons of Elizaphan, Shemaiah, the chief, and his brethren, 200, of the sons of Hebron, Eliel, the chief, and his brethren, fourscore. Of the sons of Uziel, Abinadab, the chief, and his brethren, 112. And David called for Zadok and Abiathar, the priests, and for the Levites, for Uriel, Asaiah, and Joel, Shemaiah, and Eliel, and Abinadab, and said unto them, Ye are the chief of the fathers of the Levites, sanctify yourselves both ye and your brethren, that ye may bring up the ark of the Lord God of Israel unto the place that I have prepared for it. For because ye did it not at the first, the Lord our God made a breach upon us, for that we sought him not after the due order. So the priests and the Levites sanctified themselves to bring up the ark of the Lord God of Israel, and the children of the Levites bear the ark of God upon their shoulders with the staves thereon, and Moses commanded according to the word, as Moses commanded according to the word of the Lord. And David spake to the chief of the Levites to appoint their brethren to be singers with instruments of music, psalteries, and harps, cymbals sounding by lifting up the voice with joy. So the Levites appointed Heman, the son of Joel, and of his brethren, Asaph, the son of Berechiah, and of the sons of Merari, their brethren, Ethan, the son of Cushaiah, and with them their brethren of the second degree, Zechariah, Ben, and Jaziel, and Shimarimoth, and Jehiel, and Unai, and Eliab, and Beniah, and Mesaiah, and Mattathiah, and Eliphele, and Mikniah, and Obed Edom, and Jael, the porters. So the singers, Heman, Asaph, and Ethan were appointed to sound with cymbals of brass, and Zechariah, and Aziel, and Shimiramoth, and Jehiel, and Unai, and Eliab, and Mesiah, and Benaniah, with psalteries on Alamoth, and Mathathiah, and Eliphelath, and Mikniahiah, and Obed-Edom, and Jael, and Azaziah, with harps on Sheminith to excel. And Chenaniah, chief of the Levites, was for song. He instructed about the song because he was skillful. And Berechiah and Elikanah were doorkeepers for the ark. And Shebaniah, and Jehoshaphat, and Nethaniel, and Amasai, and Zechariah, and Beniah, and Eliezer, the priest, did blow with the trumpets before the ark of God. And Obed-Edom, and Jehiah, were doorkeepers for the ark. So David, and the elders of Israel, and the captains over thousands, went to bring up the ark of the covenant of the Lord out of the house of Obed-Edom with joy. And it came to pass, when God helped the Levites to bear the ark of the covenant of the Lord, that they offered seven bullocks and seven rams. And David was clothed with a robe of fine linen, and all the Levites that bear the ark, and the singers, and Chaniah, Chenaniah, the master of the song with the singers. David also had upon him an ephod of linen. Thus also all Israel brought up the ark of the covenant of the Lord with shouting and with the sound of cornet and with trumpets and with cymbals, making a noise with psalteries and harps. And it came to pass as the ark of the covenant of the Lord came to the city of David that Michael, the daughter of Saul, looked 
looking out at a window, saw King David dancing and playing, and she despised him in her heart. The word of the Lord. <laughs>